is Ashley here, welcome back to another Wars video. Today, I'm going to be giving my preview for tomorrow night's game at home to Derby. Another massive game. Um, it was absolute scenes on Friday night as uh, we beat Cardiff 1-0 uh, in a potential uh, title winning uh, a title winning affair. Um, uh, we beat them 1-0. Two uh, opportunities for Cardiff to snatch a point from that game. Not taken, um, one saved by John Roddy and one uh, clattering the crossbar. But now we look ahead to the game against Derby tomorrow night, which is another great opportunity to get a close, uh, a step closer to the Premier League. We need just five points, a maximum of five points now, to clinch promotion back to the Premier League. Um, after six years away, so a win against Derby and a win against Blues would do it. Or we could get a win against um, Derby and a draw against Blues, or vice versa. If Fulham do slip up as well, uh, I do believe they are playing tonight against Reading. Um, so they should win that one. But if they do, if they do slip up. Um, and and we do win against Derby. That means we only need one more point, I do believe. Um, so we can we can win against Derby, and then if Fulham slip up tonight, um, then that means we only need just one point from Blue uh, the Blues game at home as well uh, to get promoted. What like in, in just imagine the scenes getting promoted. Uh, in the local derby, um, getting promoted um, get against one of your local rivals. It's it, it, imagine the scenes. Uh, and mind you, if that actually happened um, on Sunday, if that actually happened on Sunday, that would be absolutely epic. Um, I can't imagine what I'll, my reaction would be like. I'd probably be like screaming against the TV or something. But anyway, um, this is a game we can definitely win. The character we showed uh, against Cardiff on Friday night was absolutely incredible. Uh, the defensive display was absolutely brilliant. One of the best defensive displays I've seen all season uh, from us. Uh, John Ruddy abs absolutely had an absolutely crazy, crazy game. Uh, pulled off some great saves uh, to keep, obviously, that penalty save uh, to keep us at 1-0. And also, um, when um, Wildschutz um, took a uh, took a free kick in the game, uh, once he managed it, he managed it to, to parry it out, which was another key save. Um, as he has been under a, um, a large amount of criticism over the past couple of months for his uh, goalkeeping abilities. Obviously, he ha he's had a bit of stumbles, especially in, in that game against Norwich in in, uh, in late February, um, where we were 2 0 up and then um, John Ruddy uh, let that audacious effort from Oliviera in uh, for Norwich to snatch a point and draw 2 2. Um, so he has been under a few, uh, a fair few bits of criticism uh, over the past couple of months, but that game against Cardiff, I'm sure, just silenced most of uh, the critics that he had um, because that was an absolutely outstanding performance, one of the best performances um, he's had all season, really. Um, but anyway, coming into this game, I feel like I feel like we're going to win two 0 I just had that good feeling that. After that Cardiff game, after that Cardiff game, we well come into this game with so, so much confidence. Um, obviously, the last time we played at home didn't end exactly well. We went one 0 up through a Diego Jota penalty, then David Marler converted a penalty uh, to put a uh, whole level. Then Ryan Bennett scored a own goal and Hull went two one up, and then uh, the youngster uh, Oscar Burr. Rasmussen uh, managed managed to snatch a point for us later on. Wasn't the, the best of performances uh, at home last time out, but uh, in in this in this game against Derby, especially the game we just come back off, um, I bet 
we're going to come into this game with so much confidence um, and um, hopefully it will be too much for Derby. Uh, or, even though Derby uh, um, are coming off the back of a victory themselves um, after uh, a victory at home over Bolton. So they've just come uh, back of a good result. They've got some quality players. They've got Matt, including Mate Vidra, who's still, I think, currently the top scorer in the championship right now. So... So we've got to be careful of him as well. Uh, we really have got to be careful of him because he's better. Matteo Vidra. He, he's almost guaranteed to start against us, and and um, since he's a top scorer in the championship, it's inevitable that he's probably going to find the back of the net. But I'm I'm just hoping that he has an off day today. He has a, it, uh, not today. So, sorry, tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow, tomorrow night. Um, hopefully, he does have an off day. And uh, we can clinch the win, uh, clinch promotion, hopefully, uh, against Blues on Sunday. So, just basically, two more wins and we're up, basically. So we could do it again against Blues. If we win against Derby, we could basically clinch promotion against Blues, regardless of Fulham's result. But we could do it a bit easier against Blues by just snatching a draw if Fulham do slip up um, against Reading. So... Yeah, um, I'm going for the two 0 but I'm I'm just it's just inevitable. Mate Vidra is the top scorer in the championship. It's ju it's just inevitable. It's inevitable that he's going to score. Um, but hopefully, uh, John Ruddy can put in another good performance and um, keep those Mate Vidra attempts um, out of the net. So. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully by the end of tomorrow we will be one win away, one win away from the promised land, um, and to get that against Blues on Sunday would be absolutely massive, absolutely massive, at home as well, at home, to clinch the promotion against one of our local rivals in Birmingham, at home, at Molyneux, <sighs> absolutely insane, um, so... Yeah, and also, if we do clinch promotion against Blues, um, it'll be a repeat of the um, QPR feat in 2009 when we clinched promotion um, after beating QPR 1-0 at home as well. So hopefully we can repeat the same feat again um, by beating Blues at home on Sunday to clinch promotion back to the Premier League. But anyway... Uh, if you did enjoy uh, this Wolves video, make sure to smash that like button, and I shall see you tomorrow, wait, no, on Thursday, sorry, um, with a review of the Derby game, and hopefully by then, we'll be one win away from promotion. Until then, goodbye, guys!